Hey guys, this is Ma Piper here. Ah, man, I'm sorry for the absence. Um, it's been a very hectic couple of months. I think the last video I made was a month ago. Uh, a little bit of update. My sister got married, so that was an, an awesome time. Um, I'm doing like a weight loss competition with my brother. Uh, I don't know if you see it in me from looking at my other videos, but I'm down about 11 pounds. I'm finally under 200 again. I'm pretty happy about that, but the competition goes for like another two months. So, and it's overall weight loss and he started at like 220. So he might win just because he's got more to lose, but, um, I've been doing pretty good with it. Dropping weight consistently, eating better, stuff like that, but. Uh, I took a kind of a hiatus from the pipe smoking and the pipe making for a while. Um, the bugs are just so bad in my area. I can't even enjoy going outside in this humidity and heat and getting eaten alive. So pretty much it's just been cigars when I can while I'm at my dad's house or my buddy's house or something like that. But I've finally found something that I really love doing. Um, I can't wait to get back to pipes. I really want to get back to smoking pipes. I've been just, I've been jonesing for it. It's just, the weather is not friendly right now for it. It's calling for rain like pretty much the next week and a half. And it's muggy. But, uh, talking to my buddies on Voxer, um, I usually talk to, uh, my four buddies. I got, uh, the Dreadlock Piper. Uh, ben the Bag Piper, Scotty Piper, and Sander Texan. And uh, we chat every day. And they are all big dip guys. They love the dip. And I've tried it one time. And I just couldn't wrap my head around. I, I just felt uh, with the looseness in my lip. I just didn't like it. And I was trying to find something I can do while I'm at work that won't bring too much attention. So I only gave it one shot. I did not like it. Um, but then I noticed that they do the, the portion pouches. And I tried that. And that wasn't bad. You still had a spit. But you don't have stuff floating all around in your mouth and stuff like that. So that wasn't too bad. But then I totaled my car. I, uh, some lady slammed on her brakes to make a left-hand turn even though there was no traffic and she had no reason to slam on her brakes and there's a guy in front of me who slammed on his brakes and i slammed on mine and my tiny little toyota corolla did not even stand a chance against a uh a ford f-150 4x4 that had a big giant like it was like this big trailer hitch and I didn't even hit his bumper it just it stopped on the trailer hitch but it blew my engine apart so we got a new car got a 2016 Jeep uh, compass which is actually pretty awesome so now we have two SUVs so that's the silver lining to it but it sucked but my wife felt bad. I was having a bum day and she went to Wawa and she brought home Skull Snooze. And I'm like, okay, Snooze. It goes in your upper lip. You don't have to worry about spitting, nothing like that. You know, okay, I'll give that a shot. And that's where my thing took off. I've been obsessed with Snooze lately. Um, went on a couple of different sites. So the first one I got was the Jacobson Wintergreen. Um... I enjoy it. it. It probably only has about 8 to 9 milligrams of nicotine in it. So if I want to feel that little head rush from the nicotine, I definitely have to do um, two of them. But this is moist. So it definitely produces a lot of spit. Like you don't have to, um, you don't have to spit it, but I always spit it. Um, this is the latest snooze I got. This is like the little portions. Uh, I have not gone ahead and done any of the loose snooze. It smells so good though. 
Mm. Yeah, there. So I'll get to that one in a minute. So then the other ones I've been loving, and I, because I've been watching what I eat, I stop drinking beer, sodas, sugars, chips, stuff like that. Very small portions of uh, food, trying to do a little bit more of a higher protein, low carb diet. And uh, so my stomach is usually always like empty. But I'm mostly a, um, a bored eater. Uh, when I'm bored, I just snack. So I bought these. Uh, it's called Odin's. These are, I had to get these on MrSnuff.com. And this is Swedish snooze made in Sweden. I mean, it's all different language on the back. Um, but I can read the front. Everything's in English. So I've actually tried these two. Uh, I think I started with this one. And they are, same thing, portions. Um, same. Oh, man down. These ones are portions as well. Um, I think the only thing that difference is, is there's more in here. I think this is a, uh, no, they're the same. They're both 10 gram, uh, gram tins. Um, about 15 pouches in each. So that's not bad. But I threw one in yesterday. I was at a party. Um, and I'll tell you what, it was like somebody hit me in the back of the head. It, I had to sit down. It made me so lightheaded. It was awesome. Um, this is the other one I got, and I need to try this one still, but I already have two open, so I'm going to hold off on it, but, uh, this is just Odin's White. Um, so I'm looking forward to trying this one, and this one's a 20 gram. So, the one I just stuck in, and I stuck it in now while I'm talking to see if I can get a reaction from it, so it's on video, but... Kind of like it a little bit more in the front. It kind of wanders because it's not like a lot in the pouch. But uh, this is Siberia. And this is the most nicotine that you get in the, um, in the pouches. I mean, same thing, portion. But these are, they boast that it's five times the amount of a normal one of these so this is eight eight to nine five times yeah, this is like 43 milligrams of nicotine in it where these ones all boasted about 22 um and i figured if this is 22 and it kind of made me a little lightheaded i was kind of wondering what this one's gonna do so i put it in i can actually start to feel it now like it's starting to hit whoa And it's like a, a nice icy mint esque uh, flavor to it. Um, God, got bear on it and everything. <laughs> I don't know if you can see the bear. There you go. Let me kind of focus on there. Siberia, minus 80 degrees Celsius. And it's all written in Russian. So I don't know why this, this was under the Swedish news section, but. Um, Man, it's so crazy how they have just an alphabet that's completely different from us. That's nuts. Um, but anyway, that was just, I haven't made a video in so long, and I've been wanting to make a video, and I didn't know what about, but so, ooh. yeah, it's definitely starting to hit now. Um, and I purposely did it now because I didn't do anything since, uh, like, maybe 1 o'clock, so I was kind of hoping everything was out of my system now. Um, but yeah, uh, so this is what I've been into lately, uh, this, cigars, and of course, my bourbon, uh, can't go wrong with bourbon, went to a party yesterday, I took that sampler pack I had in a few of my videos a while back, and they're all gone, because I haven't drank any of those since I tried the samples of them all, and me and my brother-in-law just went through the whole thing, it was awesome, we had a slip and slide, um, it was raining, you know, I just, I don't know if you can see, but this is all right here. The scratching, this is just all dirt that was on the slip and slide from running. And I just, because me and uh, me and my buddy Mike were doing like tricks, like we would run and try to 
spin or go feet first and stuff like that and it just tore my arm up um but that was that was a blast so i mean obviously drinking bourbon and it was cool because my uh i had a relative from germany that was visiting for like she was here for like four weeks but she was visiting some relatives in pennsylvania and she's been staying with my grandparents for the past two weeks so it was kind of funny because drinking age over in germany is 16 and so we were we were drinking with her, you know, we weren't going to a bar or anything like that, but, I, you know, I, I laughed because, and for those guys who drink, like, PBR and stuff like that, standard Texan, um, <laughs> it was funny because, like, the Germans, they make fun of the Americans for watering down the beer, and I was drinking a porch rocker, and I, I love the porch rocker, it's, it's a lemony, uh, summer beer, and she took a sip of it, and she said, oh, yeah, we got a song about this in Germany saying that this type of beer is not alcohol. And that made me laugh. And then I wish case I gave her some of my bourbon. She's like, oh, yeah, this is this is alcohol. I'm like, damn straight, it's Kentucky bourbon. Like, better enjoy that. But anyway, that was really cool getting to catch up with her. She's only 16, but she was pretty fun. Never had Taco Bell. They don't have Taco Bell over there, so we took her to Taco Bell. And she thoroughly enjoyed that. So, America's got something going on. Taco Bell. <laughs> anyway, um, this is just a video. I'm throwing it up there. I haven't done a video in a while. So, I hope you like it. I'll try to get back into pipes and stuff like that once it gets a little cooler out. Anyway, I'm starting to get a little lightheaded now. Um, so, I'm going to sign off. And I will catch you guys. I don't know. Next time I do a video, I'll try to do it more often, but none of the content is super, super important. Just uh, having fun with it. I'll catch you guys later.